Here we are at Taco Bell. We're here to try the brand new Taco Bell French fries with chenna cheese. Just yell. I like the fries! Should I try talking to her from here? I don't know. I don't know if you can reach. Who want two of your nacho fries? Fair enough. Sorry, I'm trying to get up. Uh, can we get just two of your nacho fries? Some, and two waters too if we could. That'll be it. Um, does it come with cheddar cheese sauce? Alright, yeah, that'll be good then. Uh, yep. Thank you, thank you. Dude, that's a deal. So what is your anticipation? Like what, what are you thinking? I'm hoping that it's a step up from McDonald's fries, but not as good as like Smash Burgers Smash Fries. See, I'm hoping for like close to Five Guys Cajun fries, but not the spicy. Have you tried them yet? The nacho fries? Yeah, they are. not too much seasoning on them. Okay. Same with Five Guys fries. Perfect, thank you so much. Taco Bell. All right, so we're here. We're trying the new nacho fries at Taco Bell. I'm here with Dr. Quinn. We got Big D Dallas here. Is that my nickname? Is there any other nicknames you want for me? Kenneth D. <laughs> my nick, my last name is my nickname. Is that well, it's emphasis on the D because of Dallas. All right, I'll give you that. All right, so these fries are pretty dope. They're a buck a piece. Um, you get the fries, you get the cheese sauce. Apparently, there's seasoning on it. So, but there's too much and it's not very good. Is what she said. So we're hoping we're get we're getting the good batch here. So let's pull these out. We got a lot of seasoning on there. So you can take this, you can take that one. Got your, we got our, our, our water here, just in case we need to clear our pallets out. And then also, we got cheese sauces with them. So here are the fries, here's the cheese sauce. It comes in a little black container. Um, let's start out. Let's start out by just taking a little sip of water, clear our pallets out. I see the experts doing it on their, their food cooking shows, so I figure we might as well try it too. Need a little piece of ginger, like with sushi, to clean the palate. Clean the palate. Mm -hmm. Come spit it out. Gotta spit it out. That's what people do when they drink wine, and so it must be. You don't drink wine. I know. <laughs> I'm just saying it's a. Uh, it's a delicacy. All right. Water's a delicacy. We're opening up the cheese sauce. Cheese right there for you. Has a very gas station-y cheddar nacho cheese smell. Yep. I don't think we're expecting much out of the cheese sauce uh, per se, <laughs> but hopefully the fries make up for it. So let's just, it's let's just, pretty good. Let's, oh, you already tried it. I licked a little oh. bit on my finger. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're going to try some, some of these. We're going to first with the cheese sauce and then wash our palates out and then we're just going to do it by itself, okay?
Ooh, this one's really spicy. Or it looks like spicy. Mm. I'm gonna try one more. That's good. We can do that. It's like... It's like Cheetos. Right? You getting that? It's like Cheetos or Doritos no. in a fry form. Can you describe just the delicacy and the, the uniqueness of the taste? It's a... It's like Cheetos or like Doritos, but you got that really good fry. It's like mm. it's a good fry. It's not like a uh, those crappy, really skinny, crunchy fries. It's a really good, well-made fry, <clears throat> and it's it's like a Doritos, it's like a Doritos in your mouth. I don't know. I think my batch. Just take a look at that real quick, just to get a, a little idea of what it looks like. Here's a more seasoned one. That one's that's lots that's like more a, That's like a Cheeto right there. Um, all right, so let's uh, let's wash our palates out again and just try it by itself without the cheddar sauce. Oh yeah, I'm mine are almost gone though. <laughs> Dude, come on, just do one. Okay, just do one. All right, so I took the one I showed you before. I think I need to do one more swig just to make sure. Yeah, it's potent. <clears throat> this one's a good spice, seasoned one. It is even good without the cheese sauce on it. It is even good without the cheese sauce on it. Look how many they it give you. Good. Look how many they give you for a buck. This is like, this is a steal. Like, here's my hand. Okay, yeah, that's really good. Wow. And it was filled over the top. It was good. Size. For a buck. All I gotta say is, McDonald's, watch out. A new competitor just entered the fry game. And you can't compete with these. These are actually really good. I'm gonna try some cheese sauce real quick. Mm -hmm. It gets better the more you eat. <laughs> That's a bad thing to happen, but it's it's uh it's better with the cheese sauce in yep. my opinion. Yep. Still good, still edible without the cheese sauce though. Like it's yeah, it's still really good without the cheese sauce. And it's not like too oily either. You know, I think you know those guys they put fries on their burgers mm -hmm. I think these would be really good on a burger <gasps> do you think this is in preparation for Taco Bell getting burgers no do you think it is no they're gonna put these in a burrito dude <gasps> yes Del Taco's already got amazing epic burritos that has fries in them and it just makes it amazing if Taco Bell put these in burritos They'd be unstoppable. I would go here every day. No lie. It's like a breakfast burrito with hash browns in it, but it's got these spicy fries in it. So it's like just a little bit more uh, flavor in your burrito. In your burrito. And then it should come with a cup of nacho cheese sauce and pour it as you bite it like salsa. Okay, so what do you think the future of these fries are? Do you think there's going to be any any other variations of it? You know, because they do variations of tacos. They have the taco, the double decker taco. They have the regular taco. They have the Doritos Locos taco. Do you think there's going to be any other variations of these fries that they could do? I don't know. Like, do, could they do a Cool Ranch fry? Could they do a chili cheese fry? You know what I'm saying? Like, what What more? I don't think they would do a chili cheese fry because I couldn't see Taco Bell doing That's true. chili. That's true. I could see them doing the Cool Ranch flavor to it. Mm -hmm. Or even the, what's the third one? They got normal Doritos, Cool Ranch, and they got a kind of a more spicy one. Mm -hmm. We'll just call the, it the spicy Dorito. The spicy Dorito. They, they could do the spicy Dorito on these ones, on these fries. Man, this is good stuff. Alright, so let's end this review real quick.
Let's first off rate, rate it on a scale of McDonald's to Five Guys, and then we'll end with our final comments. Okay. So what, what, how would you rate it? Well, those last two fries were kind of stale, so it oh, uh, just dropped my rating a little bit. No, I'm kidding. It was McDonald's to Five Guys. McDonald's. So McDonald's like actually. What's a fry lower than McDonald's? I'd say, okay, actually, let's go from, um... Who has really skinny, crispy fries? No, 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 no. What's the, what's the, what's the place called? I hate it. Um... Has, like, people dressed up in, like, the 50s era. You know what I'm talking about. There's one in American Fork, there's one in Provo. Or not in Provo, no You know what I'm talking about? Mm -mm. Yes, you do! Is it a diner? No, it's like, it's like... Oh, you know what I'm talking in about? In-N-Out! Those fries are awful! They are the worst fries I've ever had. So on a scale of In-N-Out to Five Guys, what would you rate this? Okay. Uh, well, I was thinking with McDonald's to Five Guys, it was going to be a 7. Mm -hmm. But now that it's In-N-Out, I'm going to go with an 8.5. <laughs> oh, yeah. Because it's got a really nice thick cut fry. It's got a really nice flavor with it. Then you add that nacho cheese, and it's just really good. But it's not quite to a nine, it's not a 10. 10 would be five guys. So, eight and a half. I think that's respectable. I think I would go, like not numbering or anything, but just in ranking of order. I would first start out with In-N-Out, then I'd go Wendy's, McDonald's, um, what else? Smash Burger is a step above everything, but not as good as Five Guys. I would put this in between um, Smash Burger and a McDonald's fry. So on that scale, you're probably about an eight and a half. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, these guys just pulled up next to us, kind of creepy. They're probably doing the same thing. Dude, they're twins. They're <laughs> twins. All right, no so way. yeah, between it's a step below Smash Burger, but a step above McDonald's. Wait, I thought it was a step above Smash Burger. No, absolutely not. A step not. below. McDonald's is below, so it's a step. Then yours was more like a seven or a six and a half. Although I would no no because my 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 smash burger is like a ten, and my five guys like an eleven. So this would be like a what? this would be like a nine. Okay. 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 Yeah, I'm giving I'm giving them extra credit. I'm giving five guys extra credit because they give you more fries. They do. So they get extra credit in my book. But look at the size of this cup. The fries were stacked. Mm hmm. That's why it gets a nine. Okay. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. All right, final thoughts. Anything else you want to say about these delicious fries? I think we should go through the drive thru again. Get one more? Yeah. <laughs> Get one more. Get like three more. <laughs> we're going through the drive thru again and getting a couple more. <laughs> Let me just finish mine off real quick. <laughs> it's addicting. It's like you go for one, and you're like, mm, that was good. Go for another. Mm. You just sit there and you just munch on them. Mm. Sooner or later, you just spent 50 bucks, and they're only a dollar. Yeah, we're going through again. Mm. <laughs> That's my thoughts. All right, my final thoughts is go out, try it for yourself. If you aren't satisfied, comment in the, comment in the section below. But if you are satisfied, like this video, share this video. And you'll have a good day. Even if you are satisfied, tell us what you think. Absolutely. Tell us that we were wrong. That they should be a 10. Or a 7. Or a 7. Alright, we're going to go drive through again. Get one more round. Peace.